Yeah. Hi, my name is Josie. I'm talking to you from Transistor Radio, coming to you from Odell Park in Fredericton, New Brunswick. Uh, I'm on tour today with my bestie, uh, Jen McCreef, who's come over to do a marathon and to hang out with her bestie, Josie. Ta-da, me. Anyway, uh, I wanted to talk about something. Generally, I know in earlier posts I'd said that I didn't want to talk about how-to tips and things like that about transition. I want to be more activist type. Um, what I want to talk to you today about, though, that I think I've never seen before is laser hair removal. I've had up to 10 different sessions on my face. I've not had feminine facialization surgery or fa fa facial, you know what I mean, FFS. Can't even pronounce it myself. Um, but I have had my hair lasered off by a very painful laser. And the worst part that happens when you do get that is that, as you can see, there's a little bit of sun shining in on it right now, but you're seeing like some scruff that's on my face. And it's actually not, well, here, we got to zoom in. Look at those lips. Oh, geez. Just kidding. <sighs> Thanks, Jen. Um, it's funny when you get two straight women together, how sexually crazy that you get. What I'm saying is just basically that you're you're actually seeing what is actually false. It's actually not uh, my beard coming out. It is actually the hair that was burnt on my face turns black. And when it did turn black because of the heat of the laser, it made my face very pitted, like a golf ball. And what it does is gives you a bunch of bumps. And then those bumps take, for me, it could be up to three days for some people to go away because I just had mine done three days ago, but for me, it takes almost 10 days to get through. It is like, seriously, the worst part about getting laser. The best part is that 10 days from now, my skin is look, gonna look fabulous. The worst part is, is right now, is that it's gonna look like I've got a friggin' serious beard. It looks like I've gone six sessions back in, in what you're looking at right now. So I just want to give that to all you people out there that are actually thinking about getting laser and if they've had it and they get this and they go, wow, I look worse than what I did before, you have to give it time. It will take like three weeks or four weeks after your laser treatment, your last laser treatment, is probably the sweetest time your face is going to look the best. And then probably by week six, your hair is going to start coming in. You're going to go, okay, this is the hair that didn't actually die and is not gone. So give it time. Um, make sure you trust your uh, esthetician that is giving you laser um, and uh, exfoliate that helps a lot too and uh, to all you people who are just contemplating becoming trans who not becoming trans but if you're thinking about transitioning now I think one of the big things start this crap early if you're a male to female start this crap early well you still can because what really sucks is that you're getting laser while you're trying to pass as a woman and it's hard if you're still a guy and still passing as a guy and still living part-time as a guy, you just look like you had a bad day shaving. So, take it from two women who have been there, done this crap before, start your laser soon, give it time, just like everything in transition, it does take its time. Love you all. We'll talk to you soon.